Good morning, friends. Happy Tuesday. How you feeling this morning? Thumbs up. Somewhere in the middle. Thumbs down. I am feeling thumbs up. I'm so happy to be here with you today. Let's take a look at the cover of today's book. What do you think the setting is? Where do you think the story takes place? What do you think is this book's setting? Hmm, maybe the title will give us a clue. City Dog. What are some things you know about the city? How would you describe the city? Hmm. What is in a city? When I think of a city, I think of lots and lots of people. I think it's busy. Sometimes it's loud. Are the buildings big or small? They're really, they can be really big sometimes. There's usually lots of them. Hmm. What do you think the opposite of the city is? What is the opposite of a city? Hmm. Let's open this book and see what it's all about. City Dog. We took the dog To the country. Ooh, let's take a look at the picture of the country here. How would you describe the country? Does the country look like there's lots of people? Are there many tall buildings? Do you think it's loud or quiet? What do you think the country smells like? Do you think it smells like cars? Do you think it smells like flowers? What do you see over in this corner? Some water. This country looks like it's by some water. Hmm. Oh, wow. She didn't know when to stop walking. She didn't know when to stop barking. They took her off her leash and she got to run free. How do you think the dog is feeling? What emotions do you think it feels that it gets to just run around? Do you think that would make the dog happy? Excited? She looked for the blocks, she looked for the streets, those corners where city dogs mingle and meet. But there weren't any sidewalks, no drug stores, no bounds. Nothing but countryside rolling around. Soft grass. Grass, warm ground, rabbit holes to paw and nose, fast bikes, bare toes. Blue waves, crabs, crows. And when the red sun fell behind the hills into the sea, everybody, you and me, went home, the birds, 
the boats. And soon a yellow melon moon rose up above the wind and lit the road, trees, oats. And she, the city dog, skipped out, drinking dark air, feeling a little wild. What is she doing? While floating in the middle of the night, the melon yellow moon looked down at the pretty city dog, kicking up the countryside and smiled. The end. So what do you think after reading the story is the opposite of the city? What was the setting that the dog got to go explore? The country. Looked like she had a lot of fun too, didn't she? Have you ever been to the country? Or maybe just a really big park where you could just run around or a field. That can be so fun, can't it? Thanks so much for joining me today. Do you want to rate the book City Dog? Five being the best. Four, three, just okay. Two, one, Miss Moore. You gotta be kidding me. Thanks again for joining me and I will see you tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye.